we should state the monotone sequence theorem. That is a major theorem from the area of real analysis. To do so, we'll need a few preliminary definitions. We'll start with bounded. A sequence is bounded if there are two numbers, capital M and capital N, such that the elements of the sequence are all greater than or equal to the first number and less than or equal to the second number. A sequence is monotonic if either the terms increase as you go up or the terms decrease as you go up. The monotone sequence theorem says that a bounded monotonic sequence converges. It has a limit. And I was, as I was recording this video, I had kind of a crisis of confidence. I suddenly thought, am I sure that monotonic is the word I want here? If I'm using the word monotone down here, I have since reassured myself, monotonic and monotone mean the same thing. You can use either word here. You can use either word there. It doesn't matter. We won't use this theorem a whole lot in this class because we won't be talking about sequences a whole lot in this class. We use sequences to define something else called a series. And once we've done that, they'll move kind of into the back. Ground. Similar to calculus one, where we used limits to define derivatives and limits then moved into the background for a while.